Hey everyone, it's Jesse here. Have you ever been in a situation where you really wanted to change something in your life, but no matter what you tried, you couldn't seem to make it happen? Maybe you wanted to get into better shape, but you don't go to the gym often enough, or maybe you really wanted to become an entrepreneur so you could create more financial and time freedom for yourself, but you've never been able to come up with a good business idea. If you've ever felt like this before, guess what? You're human. Every one of us, at one time or another, is faced with a challenge that we don't know how to fix or we're totally in love with a goal that we have no idea how to reach. I've always been fascinated by this dilemma and as you probably know by now, I spend a lot of time studying productivity. And what I've learned is this. There's often a very obvious reason why we find ourselves working really hard toward a goal but not making any progress toward it. The easiest way to explain this is by looking at a picture of a tree. Imagine a big majestic tree in the middle of the summer. It should be covered in big, beautiful green leaves like all the other trees, but for some reason this one isn't. The leaves on this tree are looking kind of brown and brittle. This tree represents an area of your life where you feel things aren't going very well. Maybe your physical fitness starts looking like the brown, brittle leaves on that tree. It really bothers you that you're out of shape, and it bothers you even more that you can't seem to figure it out and fix it. It's a big deal to you, so you start doing everything you could think of. You wearing clothes that make you look thinner or more muscular, you're trying some complicated new diet. Maybe you even buy one of those shake weight things that you saw on TV or one of those little pads that shock you in your midsection and you know claim you can literally get a six pack laying on the couch. These types of things rarely ever work though because there's nearly always a deeper problem, a root cause if you will, it's not being addressed. When we do these types of things, the shortcuts, the quick fixes, it's like spraying green paint on the brown brittle leaves of an unhealthy tree and then expecting things to magically change. We desperately want the leaves to be green and beautiful again, so we try to make them green. But here's the thing. A healthy tree doesn't need any help making its leaves green. Its leaves are naturally green. If you see that the leaves on a tree are turning brown and brittle, that's usually a sign that there's something a lot deeper going on. In other words, when the leaves are not green, the problem typically has nothing to do at all with the leaves. If there's something in your life that's not working, or there's a goal you really want to reach that you just can't seem to figure out, resist the temptation to spray paint the leaves green. Instead, take the time to look below the surface and take care of the roots. If you're having trouble getting in shape because you can't seem to get yourself to go to the gym, you might realize that you don't go to large gyms because they make you feel intimidated. After realizing this, you might decide to go to a smaller gym, or you might decide to find a friend who will go with you when you go. Getting in shape may sound like a massive and complicated goal, but it's very possible that maybe one small step like this might get at the root of your problem, naturally making it easier to go to the gym and naturally resulting in you being in better shape over time. The same thing goes for big career goals like starting a business. If you really want to start a business but you can't seem to come up with a good business idea, you might find that you've been spray painting the leaves there too. Maybe you have a habit of chasing the next big thing or clicking on links that promise millions of dollars with no work when you really should be asking yourself questions like, what problems or frustrations in the world around me can I tackle and fix for other people? No matter what the challenge is that keeps you awake at night, and no matter what the dream is that makes your heart race, it's time to stop spray painting the leaves green. Take care of the roots and the leaves will become green and beautiful on their own. As always, if you have questions or experiences of your own to share, I'd love to hear about them in the comments below. Talk to you soon.